Howdy ho, everybody! Welcome back to Game Guys. Oh, I didn't start with the with the money shot. There it is. Oh, I had it all set up, and then I was. All right, let's just try. I, I set up the money shot, Dad, and then we will start the episode. Oh, hold on, let me let me get rid of this. <clears throat> Come on. For God's sake! What are you trying to do? Okay. Well, I didn't want the view notes to be there. But well, okay, it doesn't matter. It doesn't. Oh, matter. I see what you what you mean. Yeah. All right, welcome back. All right, wait, let me know when you got the money shot. That's that's fine. That's fine. This is good. Okay, uh, there we go. All right. Oh. Hi, welcome back to Game Guys. <clears throat> you know all that. We're gonna put all that shit in there. I'm just gonna leave it all in there. Cause yeah. It's, okay. Cause it's all right, Dad. So here's thing. what we're gonna do now. Turn around. Go oh, forward. No, Dad. Go forward. I want you to look down. Go to the edge, Dad. Go to the oh, okay. Dad. All Go right, well, to you the edge. Okay, you didn't look say down. That. Okay, oh, so do you see how it's glowy and swirly? Wait, yeah. don't go down there just yet. Dropping down to that specific pool, that specific part of the lake, will actually take you to a pocket dimension where the next boss fight takes place. Basically, this pocket dimension—it's this wide open lake that you can walk on. It's basically like a white void. And there's going to be a giant, like, spider creature. Oh, so we're about to do this? Yes. Oh, I thought this was one of those, hey, look at this, and you tell me about it, and then you say, but we're no, not going to do anything. No, Dad, this was a, okay. last episode was a cliffhanger ending, for sure. Oh, uh, like, literally a cliffhanger, because I'm about to jump off the cliff. Well, and yeah, because this is, this is, this is the lake. next big boss fight, Dad. So this is what, <sighs> this is, this is where they must have made Flo's, uh, lake, lake making kit. Never mind. Um, okay, so are we so, just jumping down? So is there anything that I need to know? All right, about so here's box? here. Okay, so tap up on the D pad to get some extra quicksilver bullets. Now go oh ahead God, and I heal. I don't have any. Go ahead and heal. It's okay. Well, I, and Dad, I don't have a lot of that either. I'm down to fourteen. That will be fine. Uh, you got this. Okay, here's what's gonna happen. So you're gonna you're gonna jump in. You're gonna right. immediately run to the spider once when you land on the on the lake void area. Now, once when you get to the spider, you need to hit the spider a couple times first to initiate the boss fight. Once now the spider will what, what the spider will do is will disappear and teleport somewhere else. So you have to pan your camera around, look for the spider. Then get to the spider. I want you to get like body up against the spider, and then I want you to use your executioner's gloves on the spider. One other thing I'm going to mention. Smaller spiders will be spawning. Okay, you've got an insight of 28, so it's going to be a moderate amount of smaller spiders that are going to spawn. Yeah, so if you have arachnophobia and voidophobia, this boss fight is really going to put you through the arena. No, 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 no. I'm just, all I'm doing is counting in my head how many times you're going to yell at me. Uh, so that's so now I'm going to jump on the lake. Uh, all I've heard is spiders. I'm going to jump on the lake and I, spiders, and you're going to yell at me four times. That, okay, that, ready? I, yep, let's, let's just ready? go for it. Let's go for it, yeah. <laughs> okay, so we're in the pocket dimension. It's the so white void. Go. Yep, there's the spider. Go forward. Go Hit the her. spider with the saw cleaver first. Sorry, saw spear. To initiate the boss fight, because it's currently conducting. All right, now lock onto the spider. The big spider, ignore the smaller spiders. Okay, I'm trying to, i got to get to her. Yep, yep. Then once we get to the big spider, I want you to get really close to the big spider and then use your executioner's gloves. Not on the head, but on the body. Oh. You have you to get... I know, I forgot that part. I just part. got killed! What the fuck was that?! Oh yeah, the spiders hit hard. Okay. Okay, right. I, well, I missed a detail. Rom's you, head, you, you, the spider's head, doesn't take as much damage as the body. I, 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 that was my I fault. I couldn't even get locked onto it because of all the spiders. Okay, at least I- You have, I, try I'm, free aiming it. Just don't, tr don't worry about locking on because there's so many targets. It's just going to oh, mess you God, up. My God, I, I worked, I, I, no, dad, I'm not on dad, the thing. Dad, what? dad, trust me. Okay. Turn around, pan your camera around. From here? Yes, from here. Forward. Up those stairs. That was the shortcut we unlocked. Hard left. Oops, no, Dad, when I say when I said hard left, I meant hard left into the door of the, of the building. Into 
<clears throat> oh, this yeah, that left. door. Oh, hard left. Yeah. Go up the stairs to the second floor. Go through that middle door. It'll take you back to the balcony where the uh, drop to the bosses. So this is a this is a this is a slog to get back to this guy. Not really. Trust me, Dad. It could be a lower. No, 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 oh, no, shit, no. What did I do? Why oh, did no. you? Oh, I, I thought it was my souls. Nope, that is not your souls. It's a small blood pool. Oh, uh, what do I do? What do I do, Robin? Uh, one second. Oh, you just summoned a dude to help you. Yeah. What do I do? Okay, Dad, 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 calm down. Do I traverse the fog? Wait, did you just summon the old hunter of men? I right, press start, press start, press start. Inventory. Up. Uh, silencing, silencing blank. That's silencing blank. Silencing blank. Yes, okay. press A. Use. Use. Disrupt resonance. Yes. 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 Sorry about okay. that, buddy. I, I, I wasn't paying attention. I had seen that that was a summon thing before. <clears throat> I just thought it was my souls. I nope. thought it was my. Your my, souls I mean, are never gonna effort. have like the glowy dudes. I, 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 I just I was not thinking. It's been a couple days since I traversed so the nightmare just... fog. Please, let's let's take the next attempt. All right, let's go for it, Dad. All right, so that wasn't a big deal what I just. No, did. no, no, it wasn't a big okay. deal. I, I nice. over, I just you know, once again, I get a little too okay, into so perfection, to, so to speak. I just need to execution it. Don't tr don't worry about locking on. Just position your character to the side of the giant spider's body and then press the X button. This will use the executioner's to... gloves and you'll get the full hits. Yep, yep, get to the side, get to his side. My right, dad, you, you keep leaving and entering. Now go for it, go for it. Dad, dad, dad. See how much damage you're doing? Back it up, you can heal if you need to. Holy shit! Just heal, dad, heal. Heal, they hit hard. Robin, deal with it. Robin. Dude, look at that damage against Rob. Panda came around. There Robin, he is. Robin, can I heal? Can you? Are you what? Do you want me to do anything more than what I'm doing? All right. I'm sorry. Because if you don't, then I know what I need to do. Okay. So let me do it. Got it. Instead of giving me directions and confusing me because you, it makes me think that I need to do something else. Shit. Wrong button. It's okay. It's okay, Dad. You got this. Yeah, Why when in doubt, do just anything? hit it. Hit it if you need to. Take a safety heal here. There you go. There he is. Just, just run past the spiders. Whew. If there was ever a boss to deal with your arachnophobia. Yeah, sometimes Rom wiggles around. Heal, heal, heal! These fuckers kill you. Now can I just can I just whack yeah, just, this just guy hit now? him, just hit him, just hit him, just hit him. Yeah, one hit. But now I. I'm gonna, I'm gonna it's okay, die. Dad. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You got it. You got it. You got it. You got it. Got it. You did it! Woo! You got King Cold Blood twelve. You just got a trophy. Rom the vacuous spider. Second attempt. Good job, Dad. Okay. Second attempt. Now. You should see a tall, pale, Tumerian woman crying up in the distance. Pan your camera around until you see the crying woman. Come on, there's a woman here. No, Wait, forward, get forward. There she is. Is that her? Okay. Yep, that is Queen Yarnum, uh, mother of Murgo. Former queen of the oh Empire. Oh my god, I thought I did something wrong. Nope, nope, you're good, you're good. Okay. So this is Queen Yarnum. She was, uh... She was queen of the Tumerians, an ancient 
race of civilization, ancient race of superhumans, and now the Blood Moon is active. The art in this movie, uh, in this movie, right? This is better than 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 any movie that that I any new movie that I've seen in you know five years. This this game, looks, sounds, all of it. Well, also keep in mind, a movie you just watch, a Bloodborne, you get a more emotionally attached to because of the difficulty and the tedium of the gameplay. That's why it feels more artistic than the recent movies you've seen. Robin, I, I'm not one of those fall in love with the dragon nerds, okay? No, <laughs> I just think it's a cool game. <laughs> By the way, Dad, okay. Ritual, ritual secret broken, seek the nightmare newborn. Okay, so let me explain what just happened and what you just accomplished. Look up. Deez. Ah, what's that? That is an amygdala. It is a it is a type of great one. I didn't get my blood echoes. I didn't get my blood echoes in that Dad, in that chamber. By the way, you're going to start hundred thousand blood echoes. Dad, it's okay. Dad, honestly, I, that's that's barely a level up. Now you're going to start to hear a baby cry in the distance. Now I'll tell you, I, I, well, if somebody ever steals your uh, Mountain Dew, then I'll be sure to. Remind you, it's just a Mountain Dew. Okay. Well, it is just I'm a Mountain sorry. Dew, Dad. All right, all right, all right. The Gorgon over me is what? It's an Amicadala, a great one. I'm not entirely sure. There's multiple of them all, all over Yarnum. They've okay. actually... Here's here. fun fact, Dad. Pan up. Keep the camera panned up. Well, I, I was trying to get a better look, but yep. this is as good as I can get. That okay. creature has always been there. Always been there. It's like just been Stephen invisible. Hawkins always been there? No, no, it's just since the start of the game, the creature's always been here. It's just been I'm invisible to you. It's been invisible. Okay. So these creatures have always actually been here. Now they're visible to you because you broke the rit the blood moon ritual that Rom was working on. So I mooned Rom, and so, now I can see all, all of his all of his peeps. Actually it's a she. Rom is oh. a Rom was a. Oh shit! So Rom, I wish I had known. I had known. Okay, so let me explain to you the the boss we just fought. So the spider we just fought. Okay. Was a Bergen was a former Bergen scholar. This woman named Rom. She was, I forget the exact details, but basically, a different great one, ascended Rom, into that giant spider creature that we saw. She is, she was. She is a human that actually ascended into a great one. That was the spider so I, we just fought. So I just kicked a college professor's ass. Well, more like a college PA that basically got ascended to godhood. God. Does, does the superhero world need linear man? Does it need <laughs> linear man? Oh my god, you know? You know, you, you, I tee one up for you, buddy. I tee one up for you, and you, Dad. You know that if that T, if that T was, but Dad, if that T like, was a quarter inch higher, I'd be able to get but Dad, a three percent angle trajectory. I need to explain my, to you the pedantics about why I, I specify because if they were, because if they're doing this to their own professors, that's a certain des desperation that the College of Bergenworth would be demonstrating compared to just a lower ranked, you know, PTA. I, I'm, okay. I'm just bullshitting. I, I don't know why, so why is, I fucking specified that. Well, wait a minute. Am I going to fall off this? was full I, of fucked people I, to begin I, with. I could have gotten a better look he, at this all along. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, Robin, somebody literally has to stop us from going around. All right, yes, I, I agree. Go fight something. We, we, might, we, may, might. we may want to mirror this. Mirror what? This conversation. Because <laughs> we got a little too pedantic with it. You just want like it was. It's at the fifteen minute mark. You just want to, in case you wanna. No, what this is? What are you telling me how to? Okay, look, look. Uh, is this is this son coach's dad on? I'm on sorry. Video editing or on gaming? All right. So because if we're if it's if it's coaching me on video editing, you're in the <laughs> wrong seat, buddy. If it's coaching me on gaming, and that has nothing to do with the content. Remember, it's fun when content's painful, isn't it? Isn't it? It's always fun, even if it's painful. It's fun. Let's go beat something up. Right, I'm not going to make a note about this. Let's go beat something up. All right. Oh, Dad, Whoa. go forward. I just got picked up. Yeah, you didn't see the amygdala that was there? 
Y yes, I did, but... Oh, this was supposed to happen. Was this supposed to happen? Are you looking at... You see, I don't see you half the time you're making fun of me. You have the tonsil stone this time, so now you're going to be taken to the nightmare frontier instead of just dying like you did the last time. So, because I have tonsillitis, I've got to go to. I've got to go to the. Nightmare you got the what? nightmare lecture building. Light that lamp, Dad. It's oh my okay. God! The nightmare lecture building. Oh we're man, in am college I get to, now. Well, we're in. I get to kick ass on a college campus. Uh, well, Holy actually, shit. it's it's a college campus in the nightmare realm. We are. I need. I need to. Oh no! I'm there, buddy. I'm there. <laughs> Where's the clock tower? Let's go. At Let's, ooh. Go. Let's go. Dad, speaking of the clock tower, that actually is a location in the DLC of Bloodborne, and it houses one of the most. It houses a pretty difficult boss fight. Okay, so, but it's not I know, here. I know we're not to the DLC yet. It's not we, here. We yeah, are yeah, it's a DLC. Of there this, is actually we? a clock tower area. It's called the Astral Clock Tower. Where are we going, buddy? We're going to open those doors. Right here. Yes. Go forward. You know what, Dad? Go for it. Talk to the dude at the door. There's a door. Oh. There's oh, a dude okay. there. <laughs> I was expecting to see the dude. You see the guy's face? Sort of, yeah, through the window? A little bit. A little All bit. right. Yep. Seems a little hunched over. <laughs> and I hear some somebody giggling. Yeah, it's the dude. Oh, is it? Oh, okay. yeah. I can't hear him very well because we turned everything down because you couldn't remember. Because the, the the for some reason in this game, these people talking and the and the and the and the monsters screeching are the are this on the same track. So if you don't want the monsters screeching to take your head off, you don't hear what they're saying. You can actually well, Dad. Now that I can hear you better on your microphone, you can actually increase the volume of the game now. No, Robin. I want to go kill something. All what, right, Dad. What was I like, talking to him for? I don't, because it sets up for like a cool reveal later. All right, that's patches a dude. Well, then in what that did we learn to reveal? Well, you'll see later. But there's a hunched over dude. Oh, okay, behind that he's window. hunched over. Okay, all right, okay, he was hunched over. All right, all right. Mental note: he was hunched over, and I will remember that. I promise. <laughs> okay, Dad, feel Let's free just to follow this guy. I'll okay, so. Uh, on, go ahead and explore the side rooms, but do not... All right, Dad, see see the door at the very end of this building? Go ahead and explore, but stop! Dad, stop. Wait! Stop, stop. <laughs> I need to explain something. I want you to explore this building freely. However, the door at the very end, that takes you to a whole new area. Don't... It, it teleports you to a whole new area. Don't go to the door at the end just yet. But explore the side the room rooms. For, Dad, look around the room for stuff, but don't go through any doors. Well, yeah, no, no, go through the side doors, not the main door. You have to go through oh, the side oh, doors. That's oh, why okay. I have to so, specify. Uh, we wanna be, do we want to be linear about this? I have to. I, Open do Okay, so then next door. Okay, so that, all right. Because if I say go explore, but I don't specify, you're going to just randomly open that door, and then you'll be teleported. That's why I have to get pedantic here. Because it's like, go open doors, and now I have to specify the door that will take you somewhere else, literally. Dad, let's go around um, and check all the doors on the side, but don't open the door at the end. Yeah, that's what I just said. You, you should have been a Russian novelist, buddy. You would have, you would have been a millionaire at 23. Because you use 800 words to order a cheeseburger. <laughs> Nobody cares. Nobody cares where the farmer who raised the cow that made the milk that made the cheese... Went to high school. Well, you know why? Why Can Russian I have a cheeseburger, authors? But no, the, uh, I would like the one where the guy went to high school and the. the, the... Well, Dad, okay, you know, so... you know why Russian authors were were so pedantic with their uh, with their works of literature. Ooh, this one opened. Was because they got paid by the word. So the more words they wrote, the more profit they made. So therefore, this... it made sense for Russian literature to be pedantic. Doesn't Madman's knowledge just make everything? Doesn't it make me just like? Everything like more spiders when I have can't we sell this stuff? Can I buy cool shit with my madman's knowledge? Yeah, you can Can I trade up my stuffed animals for a bigger one? So I don't have so many spiders Am I missing doors like in these little nooks and okay, I'm probably not oh wait is that a door? No, that's not a door. You were just here Wait, hang no, on. Like this. Oh, yeah, wait, open it. This... Open it. Never mind. I'm sorry. I 
It, it's starting oh, okay, to play but together. this door probably opens into, like, other doors open. All right, so I got this guy coming up here. Got my student uniform. Oh! <sighs> that was, that was me. Okay. I, I, I don't know. I don't know how challenging these things are going to be, because honestly, right now... Hey, you got the, the lecture theater if I, if I came across the old gang from the streets, they... they they would take more hits. They would take more hits than uh, than these new people. Some of these new guys do. All right, I think that's it for this room. Now, the, the, do I feed back out of here? No, no, or... no, no. Go forward. No, you're going in this direction. Across to the other yes. door. Yes. Okay. Right. Typically, if I don't specify to go back, just assume you need to keep going forward. 